Oh, shit. Thing needs a little go-go juice to wake up. Sure, but seeing as we got a lull in the lead pouring down on us... Listen, got a bad vibe about this. You? One thing at a time, Johnny. Little focus? Hmm, I get it, fine. Anyway, let's get this power sitch sorted. Now what do we have here? Should I do the trick by my eye? In you go. Fire it up. Fingers crossed. Here goes. And amaze balls. Look what I found. What do you say? There's more in the fridge. Feel free. You earned it. New look. Great. Right? Should draw less attention, too. Grab a gulp. Just earned yourself a vote, Madam President. Are you even registered? Housewarming gift from Songbird, maybe? <sighs> Wouldn't it be wonderful? And circling back to Night City, speculative chatter continues tonight around the downed passenger craft. And U.S. representatives claim President Rosalind Myers was aboard when catastrophe struck. City officials have yet to release any statement. However, one all-too-familiar figure did decide to speak out. Kurt Hansen, the self-proclaimed leader of Dogtown, called a press conference earlier today to offer his take on the situation. I'm being framed. Isn't it obvious? The NUSA's been out for my blood for years. Now I'm not without flaws. But another thing I'm not is suicidal. An attempt on the life of the head of the NUSA? What transpired in Dogtown is no trivial matter. I urge you all to consider the true motives behind this... spectacle. The NUSA will take any excuse it can get to send forces into Dogtown. And will they stop there? <laughs> no. You... Good people of Night City are next in the fucking line. Shit. Mark my Fuck words. This. Troglodyte's clever. Maybe too clever for his own good. Oh, so Hansen's decided to wave a classic false flag. So doubt, reap apprehension towards any in USA attempt to get you back. Both ends fight in the middle. Well, you sure know how to cheer people up. Some mysterious party's out to trigger war. An attempt on my life's a damn good case of spell eye. Gotta let Washington know you're alive ASAP. Ah, call Washington without knowing who'll answer, friend or foe. Or should I go outside? 
Give Hanson Snipers a big thumbs up. No, V. Neither's an option. Hear that? Footsteps. Songbird. Maybe. Can't be sure, though. It's our lucky day, Chumba. A penthouse with a view of the Cite. And lights that work. Huh. This doesn't feel right. None never does with you, does it? Fucking Killjoy. You want an angle on Hanson's airdrops? You got it. V, we need to eliminate them. Come on, man. Let's have a look around. I'll be damned. Wait. Wanna try talking first? I hope you know what you're doing. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill. Back the hell up! That's better. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill! Just... You no don't ask for this! Hear that? Footsteps. Songbird. Maybe. Can't be sure, though. It's our lucky day, Chumba. A penthouse with a view of the Cite. And lights that work. Huh. This doesn't feel right. None never does with you, does it? Fucking Killjoy. You want an angle on Hanson's airdrops? You got it. V. We need to eliminate them. Come on, man. Let's have a look around. Wait. I'll be there. Wanna try talking first? I hope you know what you're doing. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill. Just looking for a place to hole up for the night. This one's taken, clearly. Told you. So I see. This, the. Uh... Presidential suite. Shit. Word is, they a bounty on the head of Rosalind Myers. What are we gonna do about that? Had a chance to walk away. Should have taken it. Let's go, get my <laughs> Hear that? Footsteps. Songbird. Maybe. Can't be sure, though. It's our lucky day, Chumba. A penthouse with a view of the Cite. And lights that work. Huh. This doesn't feel right. None never does with you, does it? Fucking Killjoy. You want an angle on Hanson's airdrops? You got it. V. We need to eliminate them. Come on, man. Let's have a look around. I'll be damned. Wait. Wanna try talking first? I hope you know what you're doing. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill. Just looking for a place to hole up for the night. This one's taken. Clearly. Told you. So I see. This, the. Uh... Presidential suite. Shit. Word is, they a bounty on the head of Rosalind Myers. What are we gonna do about that? Come on, guys. Let's figure something out. We don't want any problems. Iron in my face? Say otherwise. This iron will stay silent, so long as you do. Now that's an idea. But our silence ain't come cheap, yeah? Whoa. Pump the brakes, man. Not now, Tay. I was negotiating. Do you remember negotiating with Hanson? What happened? Not now. I see a new US president you're talking to. Guarantee the White House can offer more than some hermit warlord. The White House? But we're already in Hanson's house. If we help each other, I'm prepared to pay double what Hanson would. 
Jacob. Mm hmm. And what's that supposed to look like exactly? There's enough space for four. Should be easy to stay out of each other's way. But if any uninvited guests arrive, we'll be counting on you to stand with us. This is your chance. There won't be another. Shit. But it might could be our last. You got a deal, Madam Prez. And... Want me a Rayfield. Jesus Christ. Aha. Uh -huh. Any model in particular? Shit, my ass will fit them all the same. Tell me where you want it parked. Will do. So long as your bodyguard don't slit our throats come nighttime. Well, V, do you plan to slit these two gentlemen's throats? Not sure I trust this silence, yo. What V means is she won't harm you as long as you don't give her reason to. Well, all fucking right. We got us a deal. I like to celebrate new chooms by tossing back a few. But T and I gots to be sharp. Airdrops come morning. Gotta get up early. Same here. Come on, V. It's been a hell of a long day. Watch the master and learn, T. Watch and learn. You're gonna get us killed one of these days. Maybe. But at least you'll kick it with a smile on your face and your balls in the right place. You pull the night shift? Well, we could call it my part of the deal. And an old habit from the Badlands. So, you a nomad? I was. Once upon a time. Abandon your family? I betrayed them. I'd rather not get into it. Sup, V? Shoot some shit with me? Then spill it, girl. Working for the press. What's it like? Feds probably pay stacks, yeah? I don't work for Myers. Call it a one-time thing. Do you shit in the storm drain and call it a toilet? Don't believe me if you want. So you a merc? Well, damn, you hit the jackpot. Uh-huh. Living the dream. Anyway, you made a wise choice for an overnight. Safe, out of the way. It's even got work and power. Mentioned airdrops before. What's that about? It's like this. Colonel Hansen runs a big market, but he's landlocked, right? Gotta get his shipments in somehow. Talking iron, ammo, meds, fucking anything. All falling out of the sky and into Kurt's lap. Now, if you know where and when to look, might fall into your lap instead. Feel me? Telling me finders keepers. Clepping from Kurt. It's kid stuff. Trickle down economics, I call it. Mention Kurt Hansen. You and him got some kind of beef? See this junk? Hansen's goons took my organic leg. <sighs> That's tough. Was it? Conflict of interest. Colonel Dipshit don't appreciate motivated entrepreneurs like myself. Wanted to start a little side biz, yeah? But I forgot all about the registration fee. Now I serve as a warning to the rest. So, one thing I don't get. Building safe, right? So why is it a total ghost town? Right. Well, that's because it's haunted. But don't worry, baby. You safe with me. Jacob. It's true. A lot of peeps died here. Mysterious circumstances. Like an aneurysm, each and every one. One time, 12 runners they found. All their brains fried. Hansen closed the house down, banned entry. And the colonel's word means lots more than some turrets and shit. 
Folks know to stay away. So what are we still doing here? Cause fuck them, that's what. And fuck urban legends. Finally. My legs are killing me. Come on, take a breather. Still nothing from So Me. Radio silence. She's never gone dark this long. Troubling, to say the least. So, what if Songbird don't show? We need to wait. It's all we can do for now. If she doesn't show, well... Then... I'll have one other option to consider. Let's table it till morning. We should get some rest. <laughs> Surreal. All of it. What's that? I'd have been home by now. Reading the evening brief, glass of water and two sleeping pills waiting on the night table. Doesn't sound like you miss it much. Hmm. <sighs> See you in the morning, V. She's on the balcony. Where's Jacob? Fresh air drop nearby. Jay went down for a look-see. Sleep okay? Night all right? Like any with a roof overhead. Claustrophobic. As for Jacob, he thrives in dreamland. Come on, baby. Ever ridden in a Rayfield? My villa with VIP friends? High society? On and on till the crack of dawn. Not man with ambitions, clearly. Those in a deviated septum. She's not here. Means she's not coming. You've seen the swarms Hansen has out hunting. I didn't have there. A possibility. One that concerns me the most. I need to find her. You don't leave your people behind enemy lines. Could it still buy that fairy tale bullshit? Whatever happened, we have to help her. Listen, no, we had a calm night, but you gotta leave Dogtown. How? In a car trunk? Fingers crossed? Hanson's waiting for that sort of desperate attempt. Okay, gotta be away. Let me think. Uh, know my share of fixers. Bet we could get one to... Out of the question. They'll hand me over to the highest bidder. Gotta talk backup plan. Not a plan. A man. The kind we need. Solomon Reed's the name. Seven years ago, he headed up our intelligence efforts in Night City. He and Somi were a team. With the conflict over, he went into hibernation. So he's out there somewhere. Reed's a man of principle. He can't be swayed, can't be bribed. If there's anyone we can trust now, it's him. Seven years undercover. Guy sounds like a true asset. Used to be with Arasaka once upon a time. Counter intel. Never saw any read on file. Above your pay grade, maybe? Consider that. Maybe I was too busy getting my hands wet and dirty. So, that's a yes. Go back, up your clearance, and check again. How do I find your guy? Guessing I can't just buzz him on his work hollow, huh? Activating a sleeper agent is no simple matter. You'll need a dog whistle. A what now? 
Don't tell him I called it that. It's a signal only Reed will hear. It'll be tricky. Huh. There was a secret comms channel accessed only from a Capitan Caliente nearby. The FIA used it before the war. The access code was... 0931. Got a bad feeling, V. Sounds way overcomplicated. Gotta be an easier way. We'll call the FIA secret agent hotline and dial his extension. No, this is the only way. Mm-hmm. So what'll happen next? Reed will need to screen you. You'll show him this. It means you work for us. What the? The file will be created for you in the FIA database. Wait, back up. Telling me I'm a special agent now? That's right. We're taking the oath make it feel more real. Secret comms line, presidential token, what's next? A coded message in today's scream sheet? That token is for your safety. If Reed isn't 100% certain I sent you, he won't hesitate to kill you. Seeing as we're on the same side, can't hurt. Oh, V. Repeat after me. I, V, do hereby solemnly swear. I, V, do hereby solemnly swear. To faithfully serve the new United States of America. Fucking pathetic. To faithfully serve the new United States of America. I vow to uphold the values set forth in the nation's constitution and represent its government with dignity and due diligence. I vow to uphold the values set forth in the nation's constitution and represent its government with dignity and due diligence. I pledge to defend my country against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Should this cause claim my life, so be it. I pledge to defend my country against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Should this cause claim my life, so be it. On behalf of all NUS citizens, I thank you. Good luck out there, V. And don't let the bastards nab you. Supposed to go to the local Capitan Caliente. Know the place? <laughs> it's not my top choice for hair of the dog, but it closed down. The business went under and the owner chose the rope. Listen, this Reed character, I think we can trust him. Seven years is a long time. Long enough to change a man. Hmm, I think so. You may be right. Or perhaps we can look at it another way. Seven years a sleeper. Any other agent would have walked out long ago. But not Reed. How'd you and so me meet? Well, she broke into my house. <laughs> Sorry, what? By which I mean a Militech data fortress. We mapped her signal at the very last second. They should have flatlined her, but... You don't kill talented teenagers when they do stupid things. You recruit them. Give kids like her a chance to make history. Reed understood that best of all. And of course he was right. You know, taking that oath, bad idea. Oh yeah? Some causes are worth pledging your life to, V. This ain't one of them. How'd you come to that? 
Cause with the biz done, their arm'll still be far up your ass and you'll be a meat puppet. No, I was once a corpo jarhead, right? Practically dove into uniform head first. They had a real hard on for the oath. Repeat after me, bloody fucking blah. But can't remember what I solemnly pledged to do. Sure you want to talk about this? Forget it. You were just do a chewing out. Thank you.